It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. It's take two. Only 45 seconds left. It was really sad. So, what else can I tell you since I'm not repeating myself? I'm not repeating myself. I got a letter yesterday from Progressive Auto Insurance. This is a bad thing. Turns out, uh, the accident I got in in July, where the guy hit me because we were both making left turns, but he was behind a van who wasn't going fast enough for him, so he tried to go around the van and then make the left turn basically at the same time as him as they turned too wide because the van was turning into the left lane so he could turn to the right lane, which would have been fine if I weren't making a left turn going in the other direction. So he comes out of the side of the van, sees me at the last second, and we barely tap because I have a Saturn, I have damage on my car, no damage on his car. Well, I mean, the front of his car already had scratch marks, but from the point of impact, it's pretty clear he already had those. And I wasn't trying to deny him getting his repairs. He didn't want any repairs because his car didn't get any damage because he had a, I don't know, some metal car. So, you know, my bumper had to push, so it was $900 to get fixed. And so I filed everything, and USAA is like, okay, we're going to pay it. And, here's your deductible back, and you know, it's, we think it's his fault, and blah, blah, blah. I was like, all right, so I forgot about it. This is July 9th when it happened. So yesterday, I get a letter in the mail, and it's from Progressive saying, we're not going to pay the claim. And I'm thinking, well, what's going to happen? Is USAA going to ask for my money back? Because if they do, then I don't know what I'm going to do. So I haven't decided, I've decided to do nothing for now. I know people that work in the insurance industry. I'll see what they have to say. But, uh, I mean, I can't say I never got the letter because, hell, I'm talking about it now. And that's, that's not how I want to do things. I've gone out of my way to do everything legitimately on this accident. I do not want to get screwed because I took the high ground. Because the whole idea is you're supposed to be rewarded for doing what's right and reporting the accident accurately. And, you know, and it all worked out the way the system has set it up for it to work out. Except now maybe it's not. I don't know how these things work. Maybe USAA eats the, the deductible. Maybe they decide from my testimony, his testimony, that it really is his fault. And if Progressive doesn't want to pay out the claim, they're not going to screw. They're not going to make me pay it. That sounds kind of naive. So we'll see. I mean, 500 bucks isn't going to kill me, but I've already got that money earmarked for other things. Like you know, when I'm 75 and you know I want to hire a hooker to organize my baseball cards. You know, I, I, I'm going to need that. You know, I, I can't, I'm not suffering now, so I can't live later. That's all the time we have for today. Visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow 